Hello friends, welcome back to channel. Today is 27th of April 2021 and in this video we are going to see the important current affairs from 27th of April 2021. Our first question is, which of the following state government has started the Jagannana Vidya Divena scheme? Answer is option number 1, Andhra Pradesh. Recently, Andhra Pradesh state government has started Jagannana Vidya Divena scheme. Jagannana Vidya Divena scheme has been launched to provide scholarships to all students who are not able to pay their fees because of their financial burden and the scheme primarily focuses on the students seeking higher education and under its preview full fee reimbursement will be given to more than 14 lakh students in the state of Andhra Pradesh under the scheme the amount will be directly credited into the accounts of students mothers so answer will be option number one Andhra Pradesh Andhra Pradesh look at map this is Andhra Pradesh Andhra Pradesh is the first state to be formed on linguistic basis in India on October 1st 1953 its capital is Amravati governor is Vishwabhusha Harichandan CM is Jagan Mohan Reddy or YS Jagan Mohan Reddy its legislature has 175 plus 58 members that is in Vidhan Sabha there are 175 and in Vidhan Parishad there are 58 members 25 members are elected to Lok Sabha and 11 members are elected to Rajya Sabha from Andhra Pradesh it borders with Telangana Chhattisgarh Odisha Tamil Nadu and Karnataka Godavari and Krishna are the main rivers of Andhra Pradesh Kuchipudi is the cultural transform of Andhra Pradesh and Andhra Pradesh has the second largest coastline in India after Gujarat of about 974 kilometers. Next, what will be India's GDP growth rate in the current financial year as predicted by SBI or State Bank of India research? Answer is option number 3. 10.4 percent the sbi or state bank of india research has recently revised india gdp growth rate to 10.4 percent from 11 percent projected earlier in the view of the increasing covid 19 related curves across the states so answer will be option number 310.4 percent next who has been appointed as the sdfc bank's part-time chairman answer is option number one atnu chakravarti look at image this is atnu chakravarti he is a 1985 batch is officer from gujarat cadder and has retired as secretary of department of economic affairs in october 2020 and recently reserve bank of india or rbi has appointed atnu chakravarti as the part-time chairman of sdfc bank HDFC Bank is an Indian banking and financial services company headquartered in Mumbai and it was formed on August 1994. Headquarter is in Mumbai and currently CEO is Shashidhar Jagdishan and recently Atnu Chakravarti has been appointed as the part-time chairman of HDFC Bank for a period of three years with effects from May 5, 2021. With this appointment, HDFC Bank has become the second private sector lender to have former bureaucrat as the post of chairman. ICICI Bank is chaired by former Petroleum Secretary and additional secretary in Finance Ministry GC Chaturvedi. So, answer will be option number two. Next, which of the following day has been celebrated as World Veter Veterinary Day in 2021? Answer is option number 3, 24th April. Recently, 24th April has been celebrated as World Veterinary Day in 2021. And this day is widely observed annually on the last Saturday of April. On the last Saturday of April every year across the world, in 2021, it falls on April 24. It is celebrated to provide global leadership for the veterinary profession and promote animal health and welfare and public health through advocacy, education and partnership. So, answer will be option number 3. Next question is, who among the following has been recently awarded with the Nelson Mandela World Humanitarian Award 2021? Award 2021. Answer is option number 4. Rumana Sena Sehgal. Rumana Sena Sehgal, software engineer turned entrepreneur from Hyderabad, and she has recently been awarded with the Nelson Mandela World Humanitarian Award 2021. She has been awarded for her contribution to the field of developing innovative and functional green products by reducing varied materials and non biodegradable materials. So, answer will be option number 4. Rumana. Sina Segal. Next question is 
विच ऑफ द फॉलोइंग डे इज सेलिब्रेट एज वर्ल्ड डे फॉर एनिमल्स इन लेबोरेटरीज एनुअली आंसर इज ऑप्शन नंबर वन ट्वेंटी फोर्थ अप्रैल एवरी ईयर ट्वेंटी फोर्थ अप्रैल इज सेलिब्रेट एज वर्ल्ड डे फॉर एनिमल्स इन लेबोरेटरीज और इट इज ऑल्सो कॉल्ड वर्ल्ड लैब एनिमल डे इट इज सेलिब्रेटेड विद द एम टू एंड सफरिंग ऑफ एनिमल्स इन लेबोरेटरीज अराउंड द वर्ल्ड एंड प्रमोट देयर रिप्लेसमेंट विद एडवांस साइंटिफिक नॉन एनिमल टेक्निक्स अपार्ट फ्रॉम दिस द वर्ल्ड वीक फॉर एनिमल्स इन लेबोरेटरीज इज सेलिब्रेटेड फ्रॉम अप्रैल ट्वेंटी टू अप्रैल ट्वेंटी सिक्स एवरी ईयर सो एंसर विल बी ऑप्शन नंबर वन नेक्स्ट हु हैज बिकम द फर्स्ट इंडियन अमेरिकन टू बी अपॉइंटेड एज द एसोसिएट अटोर्नी जनरल ऑफ द यूनाइटेड स्टेट्स एंसर इज ऑप्शन नंबर वन वनिता गुप्ता वनिता गुप्ता हैज रिसेंटली बीन अपॉइंटेड बाय जो बाइडन एडमिनिस्ट्रेशन एज एसोसिएट अटोर्नी जनरल ऑफ द यूनाइटेड स्टेट्स सो एंसर विल बी ऑप्शन नंबर वन नेक्स्ट आफ्टर द रिटायरमेंट ऑफ जस्टिस शरद अरविंद बोबड़े जस्टिस शरद अरविंद बोबड़े जस्टिस एन वी रमना हैज बिन अपॉइंटेड एज द न्यू चीफ जस्टिस ऑफ इंडिया रिसेंटली जस्टिस एन वी रमना इज द डैश सी जे आर चीफ जस्टिस ऑफ इंडिया एंसर इज ऑप्शन नंबर थ्री फोर्टी एथ फोर्टी एथ जस्टिस एन वी रमना इज द फोर्टी एथ चीफ जस्टिस ऑफ इंडिया एंड शरद अरविंद बोबड़े वॉज द फोर्टी सेवन चीफ जस्टिस ऑफ इंडिया एंड रिसेंटली ही हैज रिटायर्ड ऑन अप्रिल ट्वेंटी थर्ड ऑन अप्रिल ट्वेंटी थर्ड टू थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी वन एंड आफ्टर द आफ्टर हिज रिटायरमेंट जस्टिस एन वी रमना हैज बिन अपॉइंटेड एज द फोर्टी एथ चीफ जस्टिस ऑफ इंडिया बाई द प्रेसिडेंट ऑफ इंडिया रामनाथ कोविंद द चीफ जस्टिस ऑफ इंडिया इज द चीफ जज ऑफ सुप्रीम कोर्ट ऑफ इंडिया एज वेल एज द हाइस्ट रैंकिंग ऑफिसर ऑफ द इंडियन फेडरल judiciary and supreme court of india was formed on 28th of january 28th of january 1950 also remember article article 124 article 124 is related to establishment and constitution of supreme court of india h j kania h j kania was the first chief justice of india and justice fatima bibi was the first women judge of the supreme court of india next what will be india gdp growth rate in the current financial year as predicted by care ratings answer is option number 2 10.2% recently care ratings has predicted india gdp growth rate in the current financial year that is in 2021 22 as 10.2% so answer will be option number 3 now last question which of the following state government has recently announced to run no mask no movement campaign and sir it's option number 3 rajasthan recently the state government of rajasthan the state government of rajasthan rajasthan has announced to run a no mask no movement campaign across the state to break the infection chain and the chief minister of rajasthan ashok gehlot said that the campaign will be run with strictness so that the spread of the virus or co- corona virus could be contained so answer will be option number 3 rajasthan rajasthan look at map this is rajasthan capital is jaipur governor is kalraj mishra cm is ashok gehlot its legislature has 200 members 25 members are elected to lok sabha and 10 members are elected to rajya sabha from rajasthan it borders with punjab haryana up madhya pradesh and gujarat it is the largest state by area in india and fifth largest by population in india and also panchayat raj was first adopted in nagaur district on 2nd of october 1959 in rajasthan now we will quickly revise the questions of our last video our first question was what will be india gdp growth rate in the current financial year as predicted by india ratings and sir is option number 3 10 0.1% who among the following has been appointed as the first female president of nascom and said is option number 1 rekha menon which of the following day is celebrated as national administrative professionals day in india and said is option number 1 21st april which of the following day has recently celebrated as united nations english language day and spanish language day and said is option number 3 23rd april what is india's rank in the global energy transition index 2021 which has been recently released by wef that's world economic forum and said is option number 387 th Sixth question was which of the following day is celebrated as National Panchayat Raj Day in India and sir is option number 3 24 April which of the following state government has announced to celebrate health safety week from 22nd to 29th of April 2021 and sir is option number 2 Jharkhand which of the following state government has recently launched covid emergency loan scheme and sir is option number 4 Haryana ninth question was Kishore 
Nanda Laskar has recently died of COVID-19. He was a dash. Answer is he was actor. Option number two. Which of the following day is celebrated as World Malaria Day annually? Answer is option number three, 25th April. And who is the author of the book titled Climate Change Explained for One and All? Answer is option number two, Akash Ranison. Akash Ranison is the author of the book titled climate change explained for one and all and this was the question asked in our last video question was what will be india gdp growth rate in the current financial year as predicted by imf that is international monetary fund and that is option number three 12.5 percent now today's question question is which of the following day is celebrated as world book day annually options are 21st april 22nd april 23rd april and 24th april if you know answer of this question you can write it in the comment section below or we will discuss this question in the next video